January 2nd, pissed off at Jason. So frustrated, guys. He uh, came back from vacation. He is up 1.3% body fat. 1.3% body fat. He's got something to tell you. I got something to admit. I'm going to be admitting that I'm using gear and stuff, and I'm using different type of supplements. Um, Bob, right now I'm running tests, and the reason why I gained probably percent is because I got, I got on tests and the w holding water retention, so I blew up and gained a little bit of water weight. Not good. So I got to cut all those things out. I think I got to cut out at least that and get on the cutting agents, stay on the cutting agents. If I'm going to use, I'm going to use cutting agents, pure cutting agents, and I'm just admitting that I'm on gear. And it's the, you know, everybody has a different perception of the way they're going to look and feel and compete, but you know what? I, t I, t I take it for size gains, but I, I got to cut it out and I got to do something different. And I went up a percent and I'm pissed off about it, but it, it could have been worse. I could have went up four or five percent. Jesus, yeah, Jason, of course. You could have been obese, right? Anyways, Jason, ever since I met Jason at, at Publix at the, um, when I was checking out, not that day, I guess. He didn't admit it that day, but he's always like, I'm going to go pick up this from this person. I'm going to go get my Skittles, he calls us sometimes. It's Skittles. <laughs> uh, and I'm always like, Jason, I don't want to hear about that part of life. I'm always advocating a healthy lifestyle. I'm against steroids. I'm against pro hormones. I'm against doing it. I just want, to, I want him to do it the natural way. I mean, that's the only way you're going to get more permanent gains. You take steroids, you're going to lose it 75 to 80% within three, four weeks of coming off. It. So that's, that's pretty uh, deflating as well. Um, the only... First, people that I think should take steroids are people who are competing in Olympia. There you go. There you go. How'd you know that, Jason? You just, you just <laughs> say. People that are competing are actually going to make money out of it. Otherwise, why are you doing it? You're hurting your body just to look good for now. I mean, are you guys, you guys shouldn't be that insecure. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. If you do it natural, you will get more permanent gains. Anyways, Jason's off test. Cutting them off, right? Cutting them off. Cutting them off. All that crap. We're gonna go natural right now. We're gonna. Get his step his workouts up ten times. I uh, hear. I know in about a month we could drop me two percent. Uh, I goal. freaking hope so. In a week, let's drop you one percent, okay? Yeah. In a week from today, let's drop. Because in the past four or five days, he hasn't sent me one meal. One meal every. Yeah, but I've been I've been extremely busy with a crappy work, so I gotta I gotta make time. But tomorrow I'm I'm totally off. So Look at the camera. Tomorrow I'm totally off, so I just send pictures over and over and over again. Start up fresh and brand new. He's been working like, 34 hours a week. So. Yeah, it's been kind of picking up at Publix. Please. But he can bring food to Publix, so that's they don't want to hear that. No. I don't want to hear that. That's no, not no, an no, excuse. excuse. That's the worst excuse ever. But I'm gonna make time now. There's no excuse for it, and I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna even if I don't like it, I'm gonna do it. But you know what? So even even Adam told me when he went to he gained a couple percent. So I'm, yeah, I'm on vacation. I'm allowed to gain a couple percent. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. <laughs> vacation, you. <laughs> Vacation. Oh, so yeah. Definitely yeah, but one percent's not that. It's not the end of the world. I can definitely drop that. And I can definitely drop more. Show so. me the abs, because it's it, I, he show he comes in. No, 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 I said show me the abs, and he's like all proud of it. Oh god, yeah, yeah. And well, the mine. stomach's still flat. And it just went up a little bit. He's like, um, yeah, dude. He's all proud of him. Like, Jason, I can tell right now that you went downhill. <laughs> and sure enough, you know we do the little body fat thing, which is inaccurate, um, but. In relation to where you are when you when you first try it, when you first do it, it does stay consistent. Now it'll say I'm 14 or 15, but you know if I keep like staying on my diet and really need to see some changes, I'll drop to 13. So it's still not may not be correct. I may be lower than 13, but at least it you know it, it's, it's. Well, if it's, it's saying I'm 17, I might be 16. You don't know. <laughs> you don't know that. You don't know that. You don't know that. It could be 18 too, right? Yeah, it could be 18 too. But that's beside the point. Anyways, it stays. It's relative. Um, Jason also what a, another little topic he um he screwed me over pretty good the other day Jason you want to tell him I worked a crazy freaking schedule what do you want to tell, okay never mind. Uh, so I come back from Fiji and I've been traveling for 30 straight hours I'm pretty tired it's 10:20 at night in Miami when I granted we live an hour and 10 minutes north of Miami waiting for you know I get off the plane Jason's supposed to pick me up because he had a he had a week's notice a week's notice and um I get a text I'm at work I'm like are you you know, my wife's screaming at me, God dang, Jason! You know, God dang it, Jason! And I'm like, yeah, that little cocksucker. <laughs> Sorry, that was inappropriate. The little uh, SOB. So he was at work. So how do I get Jason back? Because I had to get, I had to pay $200 to get a cab ride home. 12-ish in the morning, I finally got home. Tired, upset. First time I've seen Jason since that day. I haven't seen Jason in two weeks, so he, obviously I'm very upset, not only with his physique, but the fact that he stood me up. So what do I gotta do to get Jason back? I was thinking, we put on a mullet wig, <laughs> we get him some, some cut off jeans, shorts, maybe some black boots, um, a trucker hat. You got a truck? No, no, no. no. We'll just make a sweatband over your mullet wig. 
and uh, maybe some flannels, a flannel shirt, and we take him to World's Gym and have him do a workout where he's picking up the Haitians with his leg poses. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Something. I don't know. You guys throw out ideas. I don't know, but I want to embarrass him because he pissed me off. And about speaking about embarrassment. Were you embarrassed at the Vitaly video, Jason? When he I was not embarrassed. Down? I was not embarrassed. He's a prankster anyway. He does that crap. So I didn't think it was bad. I thought it was pretty funny. It was yeah. having a good time. Yeah. Okay. yeah. I have a spur of the moment thing. Um, I wish the Ronnie part could have been better, but you know, you didn't really wait till I said to. To scare him. Well, no, to to approach him because he had just got there and I hadn't even. That was the first time I spoke to him. <laughs> he just come yeah, right in. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Bargain, yeah, yeah, Ronnie. Yeah. He was in the best mood. You should have waited until after because he's actually be having a good time after the video. Um, but, yeah, so no, no more movie. gear. No more gear. Gear is blowing me up. Gear is for cheaters. Yep. All right, peace out. But That's a wrap. All right, let's make sure we got this video. Yeah, we got it.